Few dogs demand an experienced owner more than the Border Collie and the Australian Shepherd. They both have a lot of charisma, a lot of energy, and a work ethic that can't be beaten. But, you are here because you are either unable to choose between these two amazing breeds, or you may just want to learn more about them. Whichever it is, this video is for you. What characteristics differentiate one from another? Which breed is the best option for you, based on your family dynamics and lifestyle? Watch to the end to find out. But before we get into the furry details, hello and welcome to Animal Digest. If you haven't already, please subscribe to get your weekly dose of pet content. Now, let's begin. In this video, we will compare the Border Collie also known as Collie, and the Australian Shepherd who is also known as Aussie. Let's start with their appearance. Border Collies and Australian Shepherds are both considered well-balanced medium-sized dogs. The Border Collie is the more slender of the two, with their average weight ranging from 30 to 55 pounds and their height from 18 to 21 inches. The Australian Shepherd is longer than tall, and averages about 15 pounds more than the Border Collie. Their height ranges from 18 to 23 inches and their weight ranges from 40 to 65 pounds. The Border Collie comes in two coat types, rough and smooth, and the breed has a much wider range of colors to choose from, which include, blue, brindle, red, gold, black, red merle, lilac, and bicolors such as, white and black, white and blue, and white and red, just to name a few. The Australian Shepherd, on the other hand, has a wavy double coat that comes in only four colors, black, red, blue merle, and red merle. Shedding Both breeds shed year-round, although their shedding seasons are heavier, and their hair may stick to your clothes, furniture, and floors, especially carpet floors. Therefore, having a vacuum cleaner is a must, and it will be used regularly. Intelligence Both dog breeds are intelligent and are among the top 20 smartest breeds in the world, as per Stanley Corin, a canine psychology professor. However, the Border Collie is referred to as a genius in the dog world, as the breed is ranked the number one smartest dog in the world, out of over 100 breeds, while the Australian Shepherd is ranked 16th. So now you know that Border Collies are smarter than all other breeds, and as such, they will often try to outsmart their owners. And, while Australian Shepherds may not be number one, they are ranked high on the list, and do take their jobs as seriously as Border Collies. Temperament Border Collies are not only intelligent, but they are also confident dogs that can be demanding at times. Owners of Border Collies must ensure that their confidence does not impact their training, since this confidence may cause the dog to become too stubborn for their own good. Border Collies are loving and obedient dogs if they are trained properly. Their confidence and intelligence make them an excellent choice for a wide range of people, including single individuals and families with children. On the other hand, Australian Shepherds are social and clingy dogs. They enjoy being petted and receiving attention from their owners. An Australian Shepherd is a dog for you, if you want a dog that will stay by your side 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. They will go to great lengths to ensure everyone is happy and to earn your attention. They love kisses, and will frequently jump on you, to show their love. Therefore, they are more likely to develop anxiety and restlessness. So, ensure that you spend a great deal of time with them, or provide them with plenty of toys to play with, if you have to leave them for a short period. If you are not looking for a clingy dog, an Aussie is probably not the best choice for you. Good with strangers. Both dogs are protective of their families, making them wary of strangers, and will bark to alert their owner of an unwelcome guest. However, Border Collies are typically friendly toward strangers, but before deciding whether a person is okay or not, a Border Collie must first get to know that individual. If you have visitors over for dinner, your Border Collie will want to get to know them first, and if they don't like them, they have a tendency to hide somewhere in the house. However, if they like your visitor, they will be outgoing and sociable in their presence. On the other hand, Australian Shepherds typically get along with anyone who is welcomed by their owner, 
whether they are people or animals, providing they are socialized from a young age, in order to avoid any aggression. Activity Level Both are working dogs and are extremely active, highly energetic, and playful. Both dogs thrive when they have a job to do. Plus, they enjoy all sorts of dog games and activities such as fetch, frisbee, agility, and other intense but fun activities. If they are inactive, they will become frustrated and distressed. So, if you are the type of owner who prefers a dainty, laid-back, easygoing companion dog, neither of these dogs is for you. Exercise Needs Given that both dogs are highly energetic, the amount of physical exercise required by both of these dogs is similar. They require at least 60 minutes of vigorous exercise per day, but the physical activity does not stop there. They also need to be kept active when indoors, and both also require a lot of mental stimulation. Therefore, it's critical to provide them with plenty of puzzle toys and games to keep them engaged when indoors. If they are not given adequate physical and mental exercise, they'll become bored and start looking for ways to entertain themselves. Which is usually destructive, like digging holes, chewing furniture, and raiding cupboards. Trainability Collies and Aussies are both intelligent dogs who can be easily trained. And as mentioned earlier, both get bored easily, so they require an experienced owner who can keep training engaging and fun. Keep in mind though, that Collies are the smartest dogs in the world, so owners should be careful not to do the same tricks over and over again. If you do, your Collie will get bored and start to act out. Plus, Border Collies will learn tricks and commands faster than Australian Shepherds. When training these dogs, it is critical to remain patient. If training becomes challenging, only use positive reinforcement techniques such as praise, extra affection, and treats. But keep it light on the treats to avoid an overweight dog. Best Home both dogs will thrive in homes with a spacious, securely fenced backyard in which they are free to roam and play at any given time during the day. Needless to say, condo and apartment dwellings are not ideal. Keep in mind that 60 minutes of vigorous exercise per day is not all they need. They also need to be active when at home, and if they are confined to a small space all day, they will not have adequate room or ability to stretch their legs and release built-up energy. If confined, they may resort to destructive behavior. Ideal Owner Both are affectionate and very loyal dogs who adore their human family, and form strong attachments to their owners. So an ideal owner should be someone who is emotional enough to return their pet's love, affection, and loyalty. Plus, both dogs have lots of energy, and need an active owner who is an outdoorsy person, who also has the time and energy to provide adequate physical and mental exercise to their pet on a daily basis. Moreover, Border Collies are not only extremely intelligent, but they are also strong-willed and require boundaries to thrive in their environment. Plus, because of their high confidence level, Border Collies must understand who is in charge or they may attempt to take over. Therefore, an ideal owner must be someone who will stand their ground as the pack leader, and use training methods that are consistent and firm, in order for a Border Collie's confidence not to become overbearing. On the other hand, Australian Shepherds are eager to please their owners, so training them should be a tad bit easier. They are more dependable than Border Collies, meaning they like to be in the company of their owners, and are more prone to separation anxiety than a Collie. As a result, an ideal owner is someone who is home for the majority of the day or has the means to hire a dog sitter. If you are a new owner who wants a dog who will be your best friend for the rest of your life, a Collie or an Aussie is a good choice. Health Problems and Life Expectancy Collies and Aussies are generally healthy dogs. But like most breeds, they are prone to some genetic or other health concerns, such as epilepsy and elbow and hip dysplasia, which can cause chronic arthritis. Border Collie's primary genetic disease of concern is, Collie Eye Anomaly, it is a mild eye disease but still a concern. Plus, another genetic disease to watch for is, NCL, this one only affects Border Collies and is rare, yet very serious. 
It's a neurological impairment that can cause death by two years old. And then there is TNS, a condition in which the bone marrow produces white cells, but lacks the ability to release the white cells into the bloodstream. Puppies affected will eventually die from this disease. For Australian shepherds, watch out for merle to merle breeding, they have an increased risk of being born deaf or blind. Nonetheless, reputable breeders are usually aware of these hereditary and breeding issues and breed strong, healthy pups. Both dogs have a life expectancy of 12 to 15 years, and we know this is based on how well we take care of our fur babies. Did we provide enough information for you to choose which dog is best suited for you? Or do you like them both? Let us know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed the video, please like, subscribe, and share. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in my next video.